Hey guys, so today I'm with a tutorial showing you how to install Preware on your HP touchpad. Now this is a pretty simple procedure, it's very similar to jailbreaking or rooting, and will allow you to install patches and apps and all kinds of stuff on your HP touchpad. So before we begin, there's a couple things you will need. Obviously you're going to need your HP touchpad, and it should be running the 3.0.2 firmware, which is the most recent version. In addition to that, you'll need the original USB cable that came with the touchpad, and a Windows or Mac computer. So to start with, it's going to be we're going to need to open up and put it into developer mode. So let's go ahead and do it. It's going to be web OS, and it's going to be 2009, then 06, 06. And when you put this in, you'll see the launch developer mode. So we'll go ahead and tap on that, let it open up, and then we just need to enable it. So we'll go ahead and click this turn on. As far as the this, we can just ignore the developer mode password, we can just hit submit and give it just one moment and we're good to go. Okay, so now that our touchpad is in developer mode, all we need to do is connect it via USB to our computer, ignoring any USB drive options, and then we can go ahead and begin. So you're going to need one program to do this, and it's going to be called WebOS Quick Install. Now I have a link in the description of the video where you can download this, uh, but of course it's very simple. So it's, it's, going to be, it's going to be the exact same file for both Windows and Mac. So you're going to need to open it up. And the first time you open it up, it will ask you to install a few drivers. That shouldn't take just a minute. Um, but once you go ahead and do that, it should pop up. Now over here on the right-hand side, you should see device. So it should automatically see your HP touchpad. So once you have this, go ahead and just click this button here. And it will download and parse all the packages that you need. And this will take just a couple of minutes. And here we go. So now we're basically done. You'll see a lot of things, for example, services, plugins, and all this kind of stuff, which is very helpful. However, what we're going to be doing is allowing us to install all of this on the device. So if we scroll down here, in fact, we'll just type it in Preware in the search. You guys will see right here. Uh, now, what Preware is is kind of like Cydia for the touchpad. So instead of having to use this to install all the apps that you want, you can do it straight from the device from Preware. So we just need to hit Install. We hit connecting and it will download and that's pretty much it guys it's very very simple you just need to install it and after you do this you can just install all the apps and mods and whatever you like from the touchpad so there we go okay so once we have preware installed it is super easy all you need to do is open up your applications it should be the first thing in your downloads and just open it up so once you open it up it will go ahead and give you some things for example some tips and all that kind of stuff but we're obviously experts so let's just go ahead and continue it will install all the stuff for the very first time and that's it. So you guys can see here it's just going to be finding all the different kinds of packages and whatnot that we just did on the computer. But of course it's going to be all on the touchpad so we can install it whenever we want. So anyway guys, it will ask you if you want to do that. Obviously we do. And there we go. So if we want we can go through available packages just like on the computer. For example, find good patches or anything else that you like. Anyway guys, that's it for my tutorial showing you how to install Preware on your HP touchpad. Like I said, it's a very, very simple procedure, a lot easier than a lot of jailbreaks and roots, and will allow you to install pretty much anything you want, no problem. Anyway guys, if you found this video helpful, definitely be sure to leave a thumbs up, and if you're interested in more, be sure to subscribe.